Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Well, that was her. She was staring at the Christmas tree and apparently moving. She's moving there. I think that's the kitchen. That's definitely the kitchen because I can see myself barely standing there. Oh, that's obviously the kitchen there. And, uh, oh, there's the stairs leading upstairs. And, oh, stockings. And that's I, that's the rawhide that I gave you guys earlier. Well, not, I gave you another one, Wicket. Obviously, Pixie had her own. She was chewing it. I was just showing Wicket the uh, slideshow of the images that actually were images of something from this. See this uh, little uh, disc-shaped object hanging off of Wicket's collar right now? It's a pet's eye view. It's a digital camera that you can pick up and snap onto your pet's collar. Um, I don't know if it, you know, is really cat or dog compatible. I mean, you could put it on anything. The idea is, is that if you place it onto a dog's collar and let them go, uh, wherever they go, then you'll find out where they went. It holds up to eight megabytes worth of data. Uh, this little, uh, this little, uh, I guess it's a device, it's a gadget for dogs and human beings as well. Um, the resolution of the images, 640 by 480. Doesn't do that well in very low light, not a surprise. Um, does not come with instructions, so you kind of have to guess as to how to get it to work. When I went to the website to look for instructions, uh, weren't there either. So, yay. I, I figured it out, I, I think, though, because, you know, Wicket, here, if you turn towards the camera, is it still blinking red? Can you still see it blinking red? I think that means that it's going. Of course, uh, what I'll do is connect it to the computer. It mounts like a, a regular old flash drive. Um, unfortunately, again, um, the manufacturer was a bit short-sighted in the sense that they used a proprietary USB cable. So it's not mini USB. Kind of disappointed about that. So you got to keep the USB cable with the device, or if you do like I do, and just put a, a label on the cable so that if you uh, lose it in a drawer, you'll be able to uh, keep track of it. All right, Wicket, let's see what we got. Here we go. Plug her in. Because I think it was going... I think that's what the red flashing light means. Thank you. Okay, you're free. We're going to connect it here onto my desktop. Let's see what we have. Does it feel better there, Wicket? Feel better? You feel free now? Let's hit escape. Ooh, nice wallpaper I got there. All right, mounts is a no-name volume. No name. And we should have images. And we do have images. Well, there's from earlier. A lot of dark, a lot more dark. Do we have them from now? I believe we do. Yeah, they, they came out all dark, unfortunately. Like I said, there's no instruction manual uh, for you to read, so you kind of have to guess as to how it works. It's, it's a good idea, in theory, if you want one for yourself, for your pet, or for you, or maybe a kid, potentially. Uh, feel free to drop me a line. Chris at Perillo.com will be posting coupons and links to where you can buy this on my blog at chris.perillo.com. It's an interesting gift idea. If you're thinking gag gift because it's not really that functional. They just didn't think it all the way through, unfortunately. Maybe these types of things will get better over time. And then it, it, it's just, it just takes static images. It's just a, like a regular old digital camera. It's not a, you know, a live streaming camera. Unlike the stream that we have going on here with hundreds of geeks from geeks.perillo.com. No, I'm not at that point yet. I'm not, I'm getting to that point, but just time it right. Some people are trying to close the video earlier. Not ready yet. So we gave you chris.perillo.com, geeks.perillo.com, and now where you come to the chat room, where we're typically talking tech 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Uh, uh, oh, the timing of the chat. You could have been part of this video if only you'd been at live. Dot Perillo.com. We'll see you later.